Hi, welcome back everybody. Here we have today a new integral. In this case we have tangent of x dx. Well, this is not a direct integral, so we can we can do this just in one step. We will need to, to do something else. But what can be done here? Well, what we know is that tangent of x it equals to sine of x over cosine of x. Well, look, I wrote here s e n, right, instead of s i n. This is the English notation and this is the Spanish notation. As far as this uh, Spanish channel, we'll, we'll use the Spanish notation s e n for the sign. Okay, well, this is just a curiosity, so <laughs> keep moving. Um, well, we said that we know this relation, right? We know that tangent of x equals to sine of x over cosine of x. So let's put it down, let's write it down here. So we'll have this equals to the integral of sine of x over cosine of x dx. And now here comes the tricky thing of today's problem, right? If we realize that sine of x, right, it's minus derivative of sine of x, we have solved the problem. Because look, we can propose the following change. We can propose, well, this is the substitution method, right? And we can propose here t equals to cosine of x, right? So if t is cosine x, right, we can, well, if we differentiate here, we'll have dt equals to minus sine of x dx. And look at this, minus dt equals to sine of x dx. But sine of x dx, you have here sine of x dx. So it's much easier now. Let's come back to yellow. So what can we do here? So if we substitute this sine of x dx and we say that that is equals to minus dt, right? And then cosine of x, we said that it equals to t, right? Look at this. This is a direct integral. So you can do this in one just in just one step, right? This equals to minus, well, we can pull our minus out of the integral, right? So you will have here t power to the minus 1, right? So here, well, dt, here you have a direct integral. You, you, you know this. This is a direct integral, and that equals to, we keep the minus here, that equals to log of t, right? Plus the constant c. So here you have, this is your answer, this is the result of this integral, and well, it was much easier than what we, we could expect it in the first, first look, you know. It was just to realize that there is this substitution change which leads to a much easier integral. Well, I hope uh, I had helped you, and uh, hope to see you again soon. Well, bye-bye.